That was loud. Okay, so today's video has been a two month in the making process and a three year vision for us since we started the channel. We are going to be giving away a pit bike, so stay tuned to the end so you guys can figure out how to win. So leave down in the comment section on who you guys think wins this build because we're gonna have a competition between Alyssa and I. It's gonna be me, but um, comment who you think. Yeah, comment yeah. who you think. Let's get started. So this is my bike. I had to get a new tube for my tire. So for my bike, I wanted to do black and white with like hints of red in it. So I did a red throttle cable and then red grips, red shifter, red gas cap. Check this out. That's sick. Caught my bar pad, carburetor, got my new chain, my coil, and then I got my twist throttle. Got my high seat. Most of my money went into my graphics. Um, and then, oh, and then I got my black plastic. So this is my clapped out 110 <laughs> that I got. I did have to buy new tubes for both the tires. We come over here to the table. I'm gonna show you guys all the parts that I got. White plastic, new axles, front and rear, chain adjustment, shifter, silver, cause I figured I didn't know exactly what my plastic room looked like at the time when I was, when I was getting my parts. Uh, I did get the Nibby uh, twist throttle with the Nibby cable, Nibby uh, PE24 carburetor, great carburetor, send it bar pad. It actually came with some sweet donuts, so this is also pretty sick. Blue grips, black uh, gas cap, RK chain. We got a brand new coil of my money on my budget on custom made graphics. Decided to go with a Goku and Vegeta themed graphics. Let's get into it. Don't need this. <laughs> Don't need this. Don't need that. That's how it's done. Woo! That's why you don't use a hammer. <laughs> okay, so once you get your mess cleaned up, you wanna make sure you always have a good clean workspace. Always, that's like number one. Let's go dump it on Greg's station. <laughs> that's how that's done. He's gonna be so pissed. There's dirt all up and everywhere now. Bad boys, bad boys. What you gonna do when they come for you? There we go. Okay, so my next project is I'm gonna start cleaning this up. I'm just gonna get rid of like all the dirt on here. Alyssa! What you do? Oh my god, we're gonna get her back for this. Gosh. She got it everywhere. Look, get in here. Look at it. It's all over the motor. It is all over the motor. It's everywhere. Well, alright. I'm just gonna have to wash everything down. It's alright. We'll sweep it all up. We'll get her back. All right, so first thing I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna start taking everything off, stripping it all the way down, get rid of everything that I don't need. Um, then I, I like to save some of the stuff, maybe we could reuse it again for other projects or just give it away to people that want it. Like maybe all those broken plastics that Alyssa threw over here. You guys can have those. Um, I'm also going to be going through and deep cleaning everything and then lock tighting all the bolts on everything on the engine bay. Uh, I was actually told that this bike doesn't have very many hours on it and it fired up and ran pretty good. So this is going to be like a great bike for someone. This is going to be awesome. Okay, so, oh gosh. So I have the chain breaker on and then you just got to twist it. <clears throat> if you had muscle, it'd be a lot easier. <clears throat> And I don't have much of that, so. Okay. There we go, now it's easier. Boom. Now you can undo it. Undo it. <laughs> okay, so there we go. That's off. And then we don't need this anymore because that's also done. Okay, so I washed the bike all up, and now I'm gonna go in with some aluminum foil, dip in some water, and then scrub this, and it will take the rust off. Look how nice that cleaned it up. It looks so much better. Okay, time to install the rear tire. Behind the scenes, Alyssa has a real mechanic doing all the work. <laughs> Good job, buddy. You ready? Oh, you need this. You got it. 
Good job. <laughs> Good job. Did you your bike? Did I finish my bike? Yeah. Uh, not yet. I still have some stuff to do. Okay, so I just took the gas tank off of my bike over here and I went to go take my, or grab my carburetor and my coil pack and it's not here. And I don't know where it is because I've checked literally everywhere. So I'm assuming that Greg probably stole it because he doesn't want me to work on my bike until he gets here, I'm assuming. So now I have to wait till he gets here to do that. That's how it is when you have um, a competition with your husband. Okay, so I just heard Greg pull up, so now I'm going to see if he took my shit. Hey. Oh, there, well, there you are. You told me you were grocery shopping. Did you take my shit? What stuff? My carburetor. Your carburetor? Yeah. No, I didn't take it. Well, then where is it? Because I don't have it. Dude, we're supposed to be here together building these bikes. No, I don't have my stuff, so where is it? Yeah, I'll, I'll give them back to you. I knew you were going to try to pull something like this to get ahead of me. So now I know that I need to hide all of my stuff so you don't take it. You know what? This is payback for getting the bike all dirty. Here you go. I guess that's true. <laughs> <laughs> you suck. Okay, so I just installed my coil and Greg, can you come over and see if I did this right? Yeah. Just make sure. Yeah, here, I'll come over. Check my work, please. Forgot to give you your spark plug, too. Oh. I fixed the new spark plugs up today. Oh, thanks. Wait, you do this? Mm-hmm. That looks super clean, super legit. And you screwed this on yourself? Yep. How'd you clean that? That looks brand new. Good job. Like, I'm, I'm rubbing off on you, aren't I? Look at this girl, knowing her dirt bikes. Hey, can you get some gas? Yeah, how much? I don't know, about six or nine dollars worth. Okay. Look at that sexy girl. Oh Alright, you better hurry up and get back so I can look at that pretty face again. Alright, love you. I'll see you in a bit. Six dollars and ninety cents. I'll take one. Thanks, Grandpa Joe. <laughs> Is for almost hitting me with the handlebars earlier. Hey, is it red? <laughs> yeah, you do a little mark. <laughs> you can throw a football better than most guys. Let's try to tell me she thought it was gonna be soft. I, I really didn't think it was gonna be that hard. <laughs> oh, well, these are some strong plastics. <laughs> Go to SSR. Ready? Yeah. This is a boomerang right here. American boomerang. It didn't come back. <laughs> Alright, let's see if this fits. It doesn't. Who wants a free dirt bike? So it's 3 a.m. right now. And Alyssa's already finished. I'm not finished yet. I still have to put my shifter on. Uh, Alyssa sabotaged me from the beginning and ordered me 
No. The raw actual <laughs> No. Bowl. Okay, so I sent her ones that I specifically wanted, and I somehow end up with two that are the same size and the wrong size. I'm pretty sure Alyssa sabotaged me from the beginning because she wanted to win. I could pull up my Amazon. I did not. Okay, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to be robbing them from my other bike, ordering some other ones. This way I can get this one done and I'm just going to have to finish in the morning. Alyssa definitely beat me as far as finishing first, which I didn't think was going to happen. But I knew this fit bike needed a little bit more work. So either way, it was a give and take. So I'll have this thing finish up in the morning. Okay, so now we're gonna finally reveal the bike to you. But first, I would just like to take a quick moment to give a huge shout out to Nibby for sending us all these parts so we can put onto these pit bikes. Uh, they have everything you could possibly need from amazing machine carburetors to throttle cables to coils to an amazing assortment of grips, which are very, very comfortable. Those soft grips are gonna feel great on your hands. You're gonna have no issues. They also do have upgraded quick throttles and I would definitely highly recommend getting one of these for your bike as well as any of their replacement parts. Also, if you guys are looking for goggles, riding jerseys, go ahead and check them out. Um, let's get back to it. jumpy you know what I mean oh yeah like I think feel like I'm gonna fall <laughs> oh my god I'm so scared For anyone who doesn't know, Alyssa just gave birth a month ago, and she looking good. <laughs> Thanks. This is your first time on a bike in what? How many months? Um, like 10 months? Like 10 months, yeah. Yep. It runs good, huh? Yeah, it does. All right, and here we are. This is our new daughter, Athena. And you guys are already familiar with Legend. Say what's up, buddy. Whose dirt bike is better? The red one. And if you guys want to enter in to win, all you guys need to do is go to throwoutfamily.com, go pick yourself up a sticker, t-shirt, every $20 you spend gets you an entry, so 20 bucks could potentially win your dirt bike. That's a pretty good deal. Also, the 
giveaway is gonna end February 10th, so enter in. Get as many entries as you possibly can. So for right now, this giveaway is only in the US, and if you guys are in other countries outside of the US, you guys can still enter in to win, but the only difference is you guys are just gonna be getting money to get the price of the bike instead. So you guys can still enter in, and what we'll do is we'll just basically buy you the same equivalent bike for the same price, and we'll send you guys the cash. So good luck. I want me a dirt bike. I want me a dirt bike. I know I changed the oil. I know I mixed the gas. But I can't crash. I can't crash. Skirt, I'm on my ass.